Alrighty, ha ha! Another weekend is upon us, which means another adventure is upon us. Don't know what I'm doing yet. We will figure that out as we go. I'm just getting outside right now and you guys are coming with me, so come on, let's go. First things first, ice, firewood, snacks. Water. Firewood. Jeez, what's going on over there, man? Settle down, yeah? And of course, snacks. I love these things right here. They are so good. And they got protein, baby. Gotta get that protein. All right, let's get outside. Let's go somewhere. Let's find a dirt road and let's camp. That's all I know. You guys are gonna discover with me. <laughs> so uh, let's get going. Yeah, let's stay back here. I'm just trying to act cool like I'm gonna trespass. It's a state trust land permit and I do have it, I bought it. I was just trying to be cool and pretend like I was trespassing. <laughs> but uh, I'm a rule biter, I'm a loser. <laughs> oh yes, another glorious dirt road. One thing that I really love about Arizona is that you can just drive out to places like this and pick a spot and that's home for the night. It's just so easy. You gotta have a permit for this spot. This is state trust land. I have that permit. And so I can just come out here, pick a spot, bada bing, bada boom, we're ready to go. I do love that about Arizona. Yeah, this is where we'll be staying for the night. This is a beautiful country. Love it. It is a bit breezy tonight, so it is already a little bit chilly. <laughs> I also have these hats from a brand that I want to shoot some content for tonight. So I think the hoodie will go to the hats. Okay, so I got the hat on, tripod set up. I don't know if you guys can really see that, but it's kind of cool with those two saguaros over there. I'm gonna go stand in the middle of those. I got my little clicker. I can stand over there and just click, 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 take some photos. And hopefully we get some good ones. Hopefully we got some good ones. <laughs> the sun is just about down. It was a beautiful, beautiful sunset. We're just gonna relax now. We're just gonna relax, chill out, enjoy the view. We have some firewood, so a little bonfire later on. Just another Arizona weekend, just camping, never gets old. Good old bubbly. Okay, now that the sun is down, 
the temperature is dropping quite a bit. Um, I just took my hat off, got crazy hat hair. <laughs> so I'm gonna change into some warmer clothes and then I'm gonna set up the firewood and get that ready to go and we'll be well on our way to a glorious, glorious Friday night. This hoodie was only for photo purposes. It is not meant to be worn in campfires. This is one of my favorite hoodies. It's my nice hoodie. I use this for nice outings. <laughs> this hoodie is warmer for one and it's more adventure based. So we can use this for the campfires. As you can see, there's hardly any clouds in the sky right now. So since there's no clouds, you already know it's gonna be a glorious, glorious starry night and I cannot wait. Okay, let's get the lighter, the fire starter. Got one left, oh my. And then my bug nets for my windows that I showed you guys a couple videos ago. Doesn't get much better than this for a Friday night. For me at least, this is what I love right here. Just get me out in nature, get me out camping. That is how I wanna spend my Friday nights. I've done the whole bar thing, the whole club thing. That just leaves me empty, man. This right here, this fills me up like, like nothing else. And it's not the nature or the, the blissfulness of, of the outdoors. I think it's more of just being able to connect with our Creator, with our Savior, our Lord Jesus Christ, the person who made and created these territories, these landscapes for us to enjoy. And I just feel His presence so strongly when I'm out here and it's just the best, best feeling ever and I love it. I cannot get enough of it. And that is why I love to spend my weekends out here doing this. It fills me up. The week can get me down, and then the weekends fill me back up, just being in the presence of the Lord. It's just the best. So I bought this firewood from like this janky little gas station. This stuff sucks. <laughs> it won't barely light. This thing has been, my fire starter has been going for like a good 10 minutes, and it, this wood is not lighting. It is terrible firewood. That is unfortunate. Let's just hope that it does end up lighting the wood. And we'll get a good burn going but as of right now it's still just my fire starter i'm pretty sure that is no good but can you guys see the moon look how pretty that is the good old moon got the fire going good now i was having trouble starting it but got it going finally so everything is good there Cacti even look cool at night. Look how cool this thing looks, even at the nighttime. It's pretty rad, man. I've been sitting around the fire now for a couple hours. It's almost 10 o'clock. So I think it's about time to start getting ready for bed. It is almost 10 o'clock and I am already so tired. I am an old man these days. <laughs> it's 10 o'clock and I just want to go to bed already. But I am one of those cool old men, all right? Don't get it confused. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to crawl into bed here. I don't really have an agenda in the morning besides coffee. Coffee is my one and only agenda every morning. That's all that matters to me. 
I will see you guys in the morning for a nice cup of joe. I'm already thinking about it. I already want it right now. <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys in the morning. morning another beautiful morning another day that the lord has made i rejoice in it hallelujah thank you for this day we slept fantastically yet again great night's sleep it's looking like a beautiful morning this morning let's get up and make a nice warm cup of coffee And now the best part. <sighs> yes. Oh no. cannot wait for this cup of coffee. This cup of coffee is going to put me exactly where I need to be. I cannot wait. So while this water boils, I'll show you guys the view. The only bummer about this view are these power lines, but it is what it is, right? Still a beautiful place to spend an evening and to spend a morning. Let's just go for a little walk. Might as well. Beautiful morning walk. You can see the superstitions way off over there. Look at this big dude. It's a big dude right there. There's our car way over yonder. Beautiful morning out here in the Arizona desert. How's our water looking? Now oh, she's getting there. She's a getting there.
Cheers. It already got a little bit warmer, so I took my puffer off. Beautiful, beautiful morning, beautiful place to enjoy a cup of coffee. Doesn't get much better than this. I love it. But look how far that clip is. I have the telephoto lens pointing way over there. It's for you guys. <laughs> okay, you guys know the drill. Once I'm finished with getting all my clips, I have to just sit soak it all in enjoy the moment be present in this moment and just appreciate all the beauty around me i'm making another cup of coffee and i'm gonna enjoy this cup of coffee without filming it just me and my coffee in this beautiful view soaking it all in appreciating it all just being present in this moment and then once we do that we'll get packed up and we'll get out of here i'm thinking we're going to start heading over toward lake roosevelt today and just kind of check that area out and see what we can find so Okay, just finished that cup of coffee. A glorious, glorious cup of coffee. Enjoyed the view, just soaked in the sunshine. Perfect, perfect morning. Now that I'm finished with that, let's get packed up and let's get back on the road. If you guys ever go camping, Make sure you bring a garbage bag so you can pack out what you pack in, all right? Don't forget that part. <laughs> Goodbye, home. It was a pleasure. Thanks for having me. All righty. We are packed up, ready to go. We're going to get back on the road, keep heading east towards Lake Roosevelt. I do have a friend though that she's gonna meet me out here tonight um, and she's gonna be camping with me tonight. So it'll be my first night camping in Arizona, not by myself. So that's gonna be nice. Let's get going. Too, where when you go through a tunnel you have to hold your breath for the whole tunnel that one was a little bit long I almost died <laughs> holy dude this is spectacular dude what is this this is superb okay we are now in globe I'm stopped here at a fries you guys can see that gonna get some stuff some snacks some more ice some more firewood for tonight kind of restock and then we will be getting over to the lake ice and agua firewood because they're all sold out there's a nice little golf course right here dude oh my I should have brought the clubs like I mentioned before one of my friends is meeting me out here to go camping with me that means I probably won't be commentating as much as I normally would like speaking to you guys as much as I normally would because I'll have company with me and I don't want to be uh, rude and just talking to a camera the whole time I'm hanging out with somebody so I'll try to get you guys some clips. Hopefully, maybe we'll fly the drone a little bit, kind of just winging it. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see where the evening takes us. There's the first glimpses of Lake Roosevelt. Oh yeah, baby. Woo!
I'm out here at Apache Lake, getting some photos. It's a beautiful, beautiful spot. We're just driving around sightseeing, seeing what we can find. It is beautiful out here. Beautiful. A beautiful sunset tonight. There's Apache Lake down there. Superstition Mountains. Fantastic. Fantastic. Dinner is served. Fireside dinner. I'm trying to get my food. This is my food. You trying to steal my food? No. <laughs> you already got half of it. You sneaky ninja. Sneaky little sneaky sneaky. Here comes the best part. You want some coffee? You want some coffee, Maya? So while I'm waiting for this water to boil, I'll show you guys the view. I was home for the night. It 
And look how big these guys are. They're ginormous. <laughs> I love it. Maya, Maya. The coffee is ready. Cheers. Oh yeah. So good. Glorious, glorious morning. All right, I'm gonna get packed up. And we're gonna go keep exploring. Goodbye, temporary home. It was a pleasure. My mind was running through the woods instead. There's this tunnel again. Scared of the, the cars? The noise, yeah. You scared of the noise? You scared of the noise, Maya? What's that noise? <laughs> Sounds like monsters. Okay. What's up guys? We are done exploring that canyon and Alexa had to go home because she is having dinner with her family tonight. So I am back to solo dolo for the rest of the today. It is about 2.30 p.m. so we have four hours until sunset so I'm thinking I'm going to go on a little hike. My god this road is bumpy.
what in the heavenly days is this? So let's get over to the trailhead. Lost my bride to the finest man she claims to have ever known. She got to the parking lot. <laughs> Looking pretty sweet. We are officially on the trail. Let's go find some views. Well, already off to a great start. Saw some big horn sheep, and that was awesome. That little baby too, so cute. It is so beautiful out here, look at this. Good, how you guys doing? Appreciate it, thank you. <laughs> We're getting a decent sweat going. Feels good. Look at that rock. That's so cool. Just surrounded by complete and utter beauty. I love it. This hike is giving me like tropical oasis, like Atlantis, Babylon type vibes. <laughs> Can't get over these views. Keep finding myself stopping and just like. <laughs> There's that rock that we pointed out earlier, so we're making progress. I can't wait to see the view from up here. I already know it's just gonna be awesome. If that's the view hiking up the trail, then you know the top's gonna be good. We just have to get up and over this, and then we should be there. Let's finish this out. So a bit of a false saddle here. I thought this was it. We actually have this now. That's all right. More time among great views. <laughs> Awesome place. That was so cool. Such an awesome view. So the sun's starting to go down. It's gonna hit this ridge and it's gonna be all shady. It's already shady all in the canyon, so I'm gonna start heading back before it starts getting too cold. Another beautiful way to end a beautiful weekend with a great view for sunset. I 
I love it. So we're almost back to the car now, and that hike was awesome. Such a cool hike, beautiful views, wildlife, sunset. Can't ask for much more. So, very happy with that. And we're almost back to the car. Woo! We made it back to the car. We completed the Peralta Trail hike up to Fremont Saddle. And that will conclude this episode that will conclude this weekend. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of this video. Subscribe so you don't miss any more adventures coming up because we're, we're gonna be going on a lot more adventures together. So be sure to subscribe so you don't miss those. It helps me out more than you know. Yeah, I'm gonna head home, get ready for the work week. Thanks for watching, thanks for coming along, thanks for joining me, thanks for being here. And until next time, don't stop exploring. And we'll see you guys in the next adventure.